I'm Jennifer Murphy, and I'm here for Orange County Business Journal's 17th Annual Family-Owned Business Awards. I can feel the excitement in the room. So many beautiful, amazing families here celebrating together on this special day. I can't wait to see who the winners are. I'm with Danielle Horton of Urban Produce, and she just won the Family Owned Business Awards for the Orange County Business Journal, she and her family, and she represented them on stage, and here she is again. Um, why don't you tell me how it felt to win? It was shocking, to be honest. I had no idea that we were going to win, but um, we feel very honored and very blessed, and it's a big deal for us. We um, are a family-run business, and it's definitely different dynamics when you work with your family, so to be recognized and honored, it's, um, it's a big deal. It's a big deal for us. And you won the Small Business Award, and that's a big category. Um, there, there were a lot of competition, and uh, but it, I'm sure it was really neat to see everyone out there supporting you, the Orange County Business Journal. Um, what would you say one of the biggest um, challenges you face as a, as a small business and family owned? Um, yeah, so I think as a small business, you definitely just have to put yourself out there and really take action how um, Alexis and Steve talked about in their keynote address to us is you really can't be afraid to put yourself out there. Um, educating the consumer about what we do is also something that we find a hurdle sometimes just because what we are doing is so different. It's very innovative. It's um, it kind of shakes the ground a little bit in the agricultural industry sometimes. So just, um, I would say really education and taking action because we are pretty much the pioneers in this industry and there's no handbook as to what you do and how you- You're not copying someone else. No. Not at all. You have to pave the way, and um, I think it's wonderful, your goal to provide organic produce for people out there. Um, that's life-changing, and I'm a big fan. And, um, and your father mentioned you have um, water in-house that you... Uh, tell me about this. Sure. So it's called atmospheric water generation. It's basically a dehumidification process where we're able to take the humidity that's captured from the plants indoors and dehumidify it and put it through a water filtration system and use that water again to feed our plants. So wow. we're right now we're producing about 300 gallons of water, which is plenty for us right now. Um, our footprint is about 5,800 square feet, but we go 25 feet high. So it's very wow. similar to like your dry cleaners that serpentines throughout the building and yeah so that is wonderful what would be um, a word of wisdom you would give to a striving entrepreneur out there that's thinking of doing something innovative and new um, don't be afraid if you think it's the weirdest idea of all it's probably the best idea of all that's needed out there so definitely don't be afraid to put yourself out there um, be a little different, be a little weird, because you never know it could change the world. <laughs> I love that. I'm kind of weird. And it sounds like your your mom and your brother are holding the fort down right now um, at the business. So I guess that's something you have to make sacrifices. And um, everyone probably has their own role, but sometimes you probably have to switch hats around and um, all kind of share the, the, the work. Yeah, definitely. We all share many hats right now. We're a very small team. Um, we only have about eight employees and we consider all of them our family. So it's definitely, my main role is marketing, but for example, I also am in charge of food safety, which is a very different role than marketing. So yeah, you kind of pick up, pick up the slack where it's needed and let people take over where they're most passionate about and their best, um, their, yeah, they do the best in and they're able to thrive in whatever position they feel the best in. So well, I'm excited. Um, I'm sure this is an indicator of the success you have ahead. So I hope you can bring fresh organic produce to everyone everywhere. So um, just keep, keep going and congrats again. Thank you. Yeah. What a wonderful event. Thank you, Orange County Business Journal, for all of your support. There's so much talent right here in Orange County. Stay tuned for more.